Yeah. Um, so on the day that policy starts, the insurer is saying, this is you, this is your life, this is what it's looking at. So this is the price that we're going to charge you for the next, I don't know, 30, 40 years. That's if you want to keep the policy that long. Um, and the same, you're going the other way as well. So you're saying, you're looking at that insurer on that day and going, right, I'm looking at your terms and conditions. This is what you offer. I'm, I'm agreeing to sign up to that. If I want it for all this time, fair enough. But if I want to cancel it in 10 years' time, that's why I might to do so. I would always say that's a good idea to get advice before cancelling things like insurances. <laughs> Um, but in terms of pricing, it's, as you say, it's completely dependent upon age, the amount of cover that you're wanting, why you're wanting it, um, your smoker status, things like this, still got things like BMI, health conditions, not all health conditions are going to influence the premium. With life insurance, you're more likely to have a premium increase if there was going to be anything happen to it than say something like an exclusion. And with critical illness cover, you're kind of a little bit hit and miss. It can be an exclusion, it can sometimes be a price increase.